News Load London presents. I, I can't think of another country, maybe Britain, uh, but definitely Canada's up there per capita for funny people. Do you think comedy can fight conspiracy theories? Isn't the whole basis of conspiracy theories comedy? <laughs> so I'd say yes, definitely. Have you heard any good ones lately? Well, I saw that on the way here, there's a little bit of graffiti with an alien, and it literally, there's on the, you'll have to find it, and it's like an alien, like all upset, going, humans aren't real. If that's not a conspiracy, let's start there, Hamilton. Fear creates division, and funny creates unity. What do you think about that? Well, the whole basis of funny is comedy is tragedy plus time, right? And uh, all fear is based on tragedy, so uh, I say yeah. 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 I say it makes sense. Do you find that Canadians are a strong influence in comedy? Uh, per capita, there's no doubt about it. Canada, I, I can't think of another country, maybe Britain, uh, but definitely Canada's up there per capita for funny people. Uh, the sad part is that we have to leave most times, but for example, in this Hall of Fame, some of these people didn't have to, like Steve Smith, like Patrick McKenna. Um, a, a fair number of them didn't have to because they came up through an era where uh, Canadian talent was supported through whether it was government grants or uh, funding and with that now shrinking we're going to find a lot more people are going to be leaving the country. This is the news load.